you doing today? Welcome to the Bells of Show. Today on the Bells of Show, we're going to come on for this morning to say good morning, of course, and to tell you it's hot again, which is okay. The other thing I want to tell you is I got a whole bunch of blood work done I did, and everything is great except for, believe it or not, my thyroid. Malfunctioning thyroid, and that's why I'm gaining weight when I'm trying to lose weight, and lose my hair, and I'm tired all the time. So we're going to go in for an ultrasound on that, and then we're going to get on some medication probably for it, and then hopefully I'll be back to normal. I've been really boggy and draggy lately for the last, I don't know, six months or so, and I can't figure out why, and I can't figure out why I'm gaining weight and not eating any more than I normally eat, and this and that and the other freaking thing, but that's why. So if you guys are having the problem, if you have dry skin, weight gain, losing hair, no energy, get your thyroid checked, because uh, that can really dick you over, Ken. But that's about it. Everything's okay, Jim. So we're good to go, except for that. But I had such a good time last weekend at the track, Grand Bend Motorplex, we're gonna maybe hit up St. Thomas Raceway this weekend. Leave your comments down below and let me know if you want some of that action. Maybe go down Friday night, come back Saturday, take the old trailer again, see if we can't get some fast cars. I got a few buddies going down. Ray's going down with his Chevy 2. Joe's going down with his full-size long box C10 pickup. All done to the knobs. Who else is going down? Trevor's going down, probably bringing his. Aaron's going down with his Mustang Chevy. Them, those, and the other ones are going down too. Don't forget to leave your comments below. Let me know if you want to go. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell bar button. Why wouldn't you? So on the last video there, I was showing you how to do a skylight. Well, what happened when I used that SR140 and come home the other night, the rubber membrane was all wavy and kind of stretched out of shape. So I'm not liking that. That's why I said in the video, don't use this. And then I said, use lap sealant instead. I'm going to let that dry, see how it looks. Put some lap sealant over it too, I don't know. I, I just don't want to screw the roof up, so. Be careful when you're using that shit on rubber roofs. I don't think it's designed for rubber roofs, and that's probably why I got cocked over. But it didn't wreck the roof, it just made it a little bigger than normal. Hopefully when it dries, it will all maybe straighten out. I don't know, but we'll have to see. Because sometimes when silicone dries, it pulls everything. So maybe it's just pull on the roof. You never know. We'll find out. That's a little update on the old Skylight Aruski. And if it's cocked over, I'll just order a, a bigger skylight and put the dome over top of that dome. And there you go. Fixed. Friggin' right, it's fixed. Maybe I should do that anyways. That way I'll have a double layer roof thing of a bobber. They're expensive as dicks. If you're looking to get one of them, you're looking at friggin', I don't know, over a couple hundred bucks. The next thing I'm gonna do is put some windows in the trailer, so that's good to come. So hang tight for that one. And maybe this winter we're gonna start to custom fabricate the interior. Make it ours, hey? Eh? Two weeks I'm off for a week. What do you wanna do? Leave a comment down below and let me know. All I know is we're going somewhere. I don't know where yet. Sean, I'll let you know where we're going in case you want him to go, but it's gonna be a midweek one. So I don't know if you can uh, get off work or not, but uh, I'll let you know if I book something because I don't know what the hell's really going on yet. I'm waiting to see if Stacy's gonna go back to work or not. If you wanna go somewhere, leave a comment down below and let me know where. Why wouldn't you? Egg salad sandwich today, just so you know. But I'm gonna roll on to work here, finish the coffee, and uh, we'll talk to you after work and let you know how things went today. Why wouldn't I? Just had a quick fly I did over the solar farm, and it looks pretty friggin' decent. So I'm gonna show you that at the end of this video, so stay tuned for that and check it out. I'm on my way home from work, and it looks like there's a storm coming. There is a little darkness action, eh? Check it out, Captain. Oh, Dick. Holy, is that ever dark over there? Wow. There was a uh, tornado touchdown between Wofford and Thedford there a couple nights ago here in Ontario, which is very rare. It's a rare for us to get a tornado. Now that I said that, watch this be a tornado over here. Frank. Why wouldn't it? I'm going home tonight and I'm going to top up the generator, put the cover on it, put the gas can in my truck Ruski, because tomorrow's payday and we'll get gas for our St. Thomas run because I am gonna go. I've decided, what the hell, let's do her, Cap. There we go. Another message sent to the old St. Thomas dragway. Oh, yeah. She's nasty over there, Cap. Easy, careful. Hopefully I get home before it starts to rain so I can get what I need to do done. Very interesting looking clouds over there they are. Pretty right there. Why wouldn't they be? I worked all day and now I have no energy and my back is killing me. Oh God, I'm getting a hole. What happened? It happened so fast. Don't forget to leave your comments down below but it happened so fast to you too. One day you're 20, next day you're older than dicks. Older than dicks with hanging balls, Captain. Careful. 
You're gonna signal one to go the other way and you turn this way, you dumb asshole. What's really going on? We need to tune this truck, Trevor. She needs a tune job. Aw, dick. We got another Chevy Silverado. It's coming in for the, the pass. Oh, now he's coming in for the slowdown. Have an eye. Why wouldn't you? He just wanted to prove to me that his truck would catch me. He said, I'll catch him in friggin' five minutes and then I'll slow down again. The corn sure popped up fast, holy crap. One day it's not even growing, the next day it's like huge. Pretty right it is, here it comes again. Just giving her up on oh, my butt ski. False alarm, settle down, what would you? Uh, the other thing I gotta do is I got some red frames in the back of my truck I gotta take out. And I got some RCs back there that's been back there since last holidays. I took them camping and I think I used it once and it was like for five minutes. And I think I might have left the battery plugged in so guess what, it's cocked over. If you're subscribed to me because of RCs, you might as well just unsubscribe right now, why wouldn't you? Please don't, but if you knew, you do. Because I don't know about the RC shit. I'm not feeling it right now, Jim. It comes in squirts. You better hang in there just in case you are subscribed for RC stuff because maybe one day I'll squirt one out. Or squirt a couple out. You never know. That's what life with Bilson is all about. You'll never know what you're going to get the next day. This channel is for a variety of goodies. Nothing like a variety. Who wants to pass a Dodge in front of me? Put your hands up. Comment down below. Because I will. I'll take them out. I'll even shut the AC off so I have more power. Are you guys ready? Because here it goes. I'm going to open her up any second now and just eat this ram up. Get ready. Here it comes. I'm doing it. Careful! He's a. But he wasn't catching me in that truck behind me. No, he was not. Overdrive. Nothing like a good old overdrive. This video's just cocked right over. I told you nothing important. Except for I'm going to the racetrack again this week. And I guess that was important. You probably wanted to know that. Careful! I put my hand on my steering wheel and it cocks the video right over. Look at it. See? Car. <coughs> Careful! Pardon me. That was rude. It's kinda. Oh, D6. No wonder why he couldn't catch me. Holy, my camera's all dicked over. It's falling off the dashboard, it is. That's from the friggin' high torque of the friggin' LS. That's what happens. They're not fast, but they're torquey. The G-forces it pulls when you do this. Oh my god, oh my neck. Holy crap. Don't be jealous now. So mama got a stung on the foot she did, and she's complaining that I haven't cut the grass in like weeks, so I think I might have to cut the grass tonight, which sucks because it's hot out and I don't want to. But I'll cut it for her because tomorrow I'll be getting the trailer ready and this and that and the other thing. And I wish they would go with me, but they don't want to. Friggin' women. Why do some women not like the races, eh? And why do some like them? I guess there's guys out there that like races and there's guys out there that doesn't like races, isn't there? I know why, because I YouTube races all the time, so drives are crazy, that's what it is. That's what I'm thinking. But anyways, I'm gonna get out, fill the generator up, and do everything I told you I was gonna do. Don't forget to subscribe, like, hit the notification bell bar button. If you wanna see races, like I said this morning, leave your comments down below, why wouldn't you? And until next time, love y'all. And you know what to do for now.